please join me in recognizing a truly great teacher, Norwalk Middle School physical education teacher, Charity Campbell, the 2012 Teacher of the Year. found out that you were the 2012 Teacher of the Year? Um, it, was, it was very exciting. I Honestly, when my uh, principal said he was going to nominate me, I was kind of like, okay, but we have such wonderful teachers here at Norwalk. I was kind of thinking, am I the right choice? And um, But I went along with it. And, and usually, you know, it's all about reading and math, and, and physical education usually takes a step behind all of those. And so it's very exciting to know that I'll be able to talk and share about how physical education can be important in the uh, in the math curriculum and the reading curriculum and help our students to to increase their knowledge in those areas. Yes, um, Brain Breaks are just classroom teachers. They have their kids sitting for 40 minutes or maybe longer at a time. I'm a middle school teacher, so 45 minutes is our time. And um, Brain Research is showing that it's 17 minutes of si sitting, you become um, your body is preparing to sleep if you don't do anything. So in seven, at 17 minute, 20 minute mark, teachers take a break from what they're doing. It could be a curricular brain break or it could be an activity brain break where they get their kids up and moving for just a minute or two. It doesn't have to take long. It doesn't take a lot of time out of their class. Gets their kids back, their brain working again, and then they're allowed to go back to their curriculum. Yeah, I do get to go out and teach other teachers and talk across the state, and I really want to introduce the brain breaks. A lot of teachers don't know about brain breaks or, or don't even think about students moving in their classroom and, and help them understand why it's important to keep our students moving and um, teach them some, some tools that they can use in their classrooms. 